guys, thanks so much for tuning in. Now today, based on the title below, we're going to be talking about how to dress for your body type, regardless of what your body type is. Now the three body types we're going to be talking about today is the average belt, the curvy belt, as well as the plus size belt, um, plus size being me obviously. So anyway, moving forward, what I did a couple months ago was I gathered a couple of my friends and I said, what makes you guys look great? What makes you feel great? Which is the most important thing. And what articles of clothing do you feel enhance your features and make yourself pop? And I got a whole bunch of different answers. I got skirts, I got pants, and I know for myself that dresses make me feel great and I feel like they also enhance my features a lot. So without further ado, if you like what you hear and you want to see how to dress for your body shape, please keep watching. Mwah. First we have my beautiful friend Fatma who we consider to be the average body type. Fatma is classy, trendy, and a girl who likes to keep it modest. Today she's wearing a dark blue denim shirt tucked into a black midi skirt with white shoes for a pop of color. She's dressing for her body type and showing off her toned figure by tucking in her denim shirt and wearing a very trendy skirt that adds a bit of oomph to her shape. By wearing a midi skirt, which is tight at the waist and kind of loose at the hips, she's focusing attention away from being drawn at her lower half. She's also elongating her legs by wearing a beautiful pair of white heels to finish this awesome, trendy autumn outfit. So secondly, we have my beautiful, curvaceous friend, Shemina. Now, Shemina has a booty, so we wanted to pair her in a pair of jeans that would bring attention to all the right places, because baby got back. Shemina is wearing medium dark wash jeans with a navy blue blouse tucked in. She's paired this look with a brown belt, a pair of really cool oxfords, and a beautiful red blazer for that awesome pop of color. Here, Shemina's defined her body shape beautifully by tucking in her blouse and wearing a belt. By tucking in that blouse and not leaving it hanging loose, she's elongating her legs and accentuating her waistline. Shemina wants to highlight her smaller waist and legs and take focus away from her behind, so she's chosen a long blazer that not only highlights her best assets, but also allows her to feel comfortable. As a final touch, she's chosen the colors that are dark. Now don't get me wrong, everyone loves their pastels, but let's be serious here ladies. Some truths are universal. Darker will always make everyone look slimmer. And that's Shemina. Lastly, we have me, and I'm considered to be a plus size girl. Because of that, I feel most comfortable in dresses that accentuate, but also minimize my problem areas, like every girl. The biggest part of my body is my hips, which means that baby doll dresses or pleated dresses are definitely the most flattering for my body shape. In this look, I'm wearing a cream colored pleated dress paired with a fur vest, black pantyhose, and kitten heels for that added room for comfort. Wearing a dress with this height and pairing it with those heels not only makes me look taller, but it also allows my legs to look leaner. As a side note, pairing this dress with a fur vest is perfect for that autumn look because not only does it add warmth to your body, it also adds a touch of glamour. Now I've paired this look with a beautiful acrylic purse, Kate Spade bracelet and a watch, as well as my Baroque Prada sunglasses. Oh yeah, and a beautiful pair of pearls from Forever 21. If you want more accessory details and outfit details, make sure you visit www.dinesahack.com. So I hope that you guys enjoyed that video. Leave me a comment below, hit that subscribe button, Leave me a like if you like this video and let me know if you guys want more videos like this because we definitely enjoyed shooting and filming. Thank you so much for tuning in. We will see you guys very, very soon. Mwah. Bye guys.